Hello and welcome, you're watching Don Bosco Media Network. This is Mona Lisa Rumbai, bringing to you the solution news across the globe. Green Maple Foundation's Green Feather Awards 2023, a national award for entertainment and development excellence, was awarded to Radio Solution 90.8 FM at a function held at Istana Resort, Darjeeling on the Saturday 1st of July. Radio Solution was established in 2016 as the first college-based community radio of North Bengal and the entire Northeast India operates out of 85-year-old Solution College Sonada, Darjeeling. On receiving the award, Father C. M. Paul, director of Silicon Radio 90.8 FM, said, This award has come to us solely due to the sincere efforts of Radio Silicon RJs, both past and present. Cheers to Team Radio Silicon. Green Maple Foundation has instituted awards in categories such as environmental management, environmental protection, safety standards, women empowerment, HR excellence, CSR excellence energy conservation, research and singing. As part of the Lebanon project initiated by the Spain Mary Help of Christians Province SMX and coordinated by the Adolson Jesus Province of the Middle East MOR, the training school for animators conducted at the Silesian House in El Hosum, Jibil. The school aims to facilitate the training of animators from Silesian houses in Syria and Lebanon, including Iraqi animators who live as refugees in the country and work in as a Silesian school in Beirut. Seven young Silesian animators from the SMX province took part in the program, accompanied by Jose Luis Navarro, provincial coordinator of missionary animation, and six animators from the Middle East province, accompanied by Father Simon Zakirian, director of the Silesian presence in Lebanon. On June 20th, after the preparations for the course with almost full teaching staff, the Spanish group together with two Lebanese teachers and one Iraqi teacher, supported by a local lo logistics team, set up the house to receive the participants. In the afternoon and at very different times, the participants arrived from Jabil, Beirut, Aleppo, Damascus and Kafrun. Then in the evening, the first international course for entertainers in the Middle East officially started. The course took place as planned, following a very similar structure every day, which was joined by moments of prayer, training, coexistence, the Eucharist, various activities and some excursions, which allowed the participants to discover the cultural and spiritual heritage of the village. From Thursday 29 June to Sunday 2nd of July, the annual meeting between Silesians engaged in the various stages of formation in Italy took place at the National Centre of Silesian Works in Rome. Starting from what emerged from last year's meeting, attention was once again placed around the theme of education and maturation of affections in their multiformity and in their relational expression, both on the side of solutions, information and on that of their trainers. Various speakers intervened who helped the participants to consider the issue in the complexity. Father Adrian Kenrad, OP, Father Andrea Bozzolo, Rector Magnificus of the Silesian Pontifical University, UPS in Rome, Sister Fulvia Sini, Abbess of the Augustinian Nuns of the Monastery of Santi Quattro Coronati, Rome, Dr. Chiara di Urbano, Consultant of the Disaster for the Clergy. In addition to the reports, ample space was given to debate and sharing of the urgencies that the formators detect in the journey of growth of the young Silesians and which they find themselves facing firsthand. More than 200 Silesians from the Central Africa Province AFC gathered on the 30th of June at the Salama community, more precisely in the Safina Cultural House to celebrate their provincial father Gilmero Basanias with joy and gratitude. The day began with a Eucharistic celebration at the Grotto dedicated to Mary Help of Christians at the Salama Institute. After Mass, all the Silesians were invited to the Maria Nyota Ya Asubui Hall to follow the first presentation of the progress of modernization works at the Afia Don Bosco Hospital in Lumbubashi and the presentation of the Silesian vows before their provincial through Father Placidi Mukundi, Director General of the Theologicum. At the end, a fraternal lunch and some station style recreational activities led by Father Emmanuel Musabila concluded the Day of Fraternity. On the occasion of International Day Against Drug Abuse and Illicit Trafficking, commemorated on 26th of July every year, the Department for Addiction, Counseling and Treatment of the Silesian Province of Trichy organized a rally in Kiranur town, Trichy, to sensitize the public on drug-related issues.
About 600 participants comprising school students, women's self-help group members, staff and beneficiaries of addiction treatment centers and officials of the town participated in the rally. The rally passed through the main streets, covering the central bus stand and market area with banners and placards, besides raising slogans against drug abuse and illicit trafficking. The director of Don Bosco Jananam, Father John Dharman SDB, introduced the UNO theme, People First, Stop Stigma and Discrimination, Strengthen Prevention for 2023. The chief guest, Mr. Anand Minakam, spoke and appreciated the service of Don Bosco all over the world for young people at risk. Father Amala Aswin, SDB, the Assistant Director, proposed the vote of thanks. So viewers, that is all we have for you today. Until we meet again, thank you for watching.